greenhouse is 12 acres. Um, we have eight acres of conventional production, which is bedding plants and hanging baskets. And we have four acres of organic production. To go along with the organics, we wanted to also have some alternative energy. Some, we're, we're large gas users in the greenhouses and large electric. So we've added a geothermal heat pump system that brings the water up from the ground to heat the greenhouse. And we also replenish that water with solar panels. We have 200 eight foot by four foot solar panels that actually harvest the energy from the sun and store the water back in the ground. We also have some high efficiency condensing boilers which use less gas and come on in tandem with the geothermal heat and we also have uh, wind energy. We started in 2005, 2006 looking at growing our crops more sustainable which you know we were we were interested in what what components and what inputs we're using how it affects uh, future generations how it affects the earth and everything and that was the basis of starting this project here and the alternative energy is something that uh, we feel very strongly about that we need to find other ways to not use so much oil and electric uh, and also one thing that pushed us is our cost. That is one thing that we could not, we had no control over what our energy would cost from year to year. So it's been really rewarding. It's changed us. We're not, uh, I've talked about this before, we're not necessarily old hippies or tree huggers or anything like that, no offense, but um, we did it for the money. Yeah, uh, we went into organics for the money, but it changed our thinking on everything also, too. Mm -hmm.